Hello, one and all, welcome back to Let's Play The Elder Scrolls Oblivion. I'm one of the tacos. When we last left off, I've done something I haven't done with a Let's Play in a long time, actually. I have reduced video settings in order to try to make the thing more stable. Um, this might seem unusual, and it seems unusual even to me, because Oblivion is a game that my computer can definitely, definitely, definitely run at full scale with no problems at all if I wasn't recording. Um, for those of you who don't do recording, especially with like programs like Fraps. I've had to explain this before, but it bears repeating. It really does have an impact on your computer and the game. It really, really does slow things down and it makes things harder to do. Which is why you don't see me record a lot of more modern games, because my computer is always a couple of years behind on the times, and while I can play those games, no problem, I, I haven't run across a game I can't play in a long time. Uh, trying to record some of those games is is a lot harder um, Just just based on how they look and everything so I have actually lowered the graphic settings to this and I will be conti Continuously tinkering with it. I still haven't figured out how to make that that effect go away, but I will be continuously tinkering with it Trying to get it to stabilize because as you can see it, it's doing that thing. It just did there where it, it hiccups like um like it, it changes. Also, I need to repair my stuff. I don't remember actually what I was doing right before I ended the last video. I remember I ended the quest and got the children's sword. But I don't remember if I had things to sell and things to repair. I hope I can help. I need things repaired. Not smart to carry around broken. Yes. And I probably Only have stuff to sell. What can I interest you in? No, maybe not. Maybe I've already done that much. Farewell. But I'm trying. I'm trying to make that stutter go away. So for the time being, we need to find another quest. Let's see. What do I want to do? How about we do that? Don't know why I've picked this one, but I'll do it. Still gonna do some quests before we end the last one, because I really want to try to uh, get some new armor, some new equipment, and especially gain some levels. I don't feel badass yet, you know? I still feel like every fight's a challenge. And I'm trying to make that feeling go away. I want easy fights. Are you Anora? Can't you see that I'm upset? Yeah, actually I can. Normally the facial expressions in this game can't, can't convey emotion, but no, you actually look pretty upset. I can't help myself. I'm just a sucker for well-heeled men. That Ola, for example, at the tap and tack. He's dreamy. And successful, too. I like your necklace. I suppose I can trust you with this information. After all, if you can help me recover my stolen gold, you may find yourself earning some of it. Okay. I know what you've heard all about Jorunda and his run-in with the town guard. Well, let's just say it isn't exactly all true. I may have let a detail or two leak out to entice someone such as you to assist me. Until you agree to my scheme, I don't want to say more. All uh -huh. I can promise is that you'll be making a lot of money. Are you in or are you out? Um... Okay... Sure. Smart answer. Here's the deal. Jorunda and I have had a rocky relationship at best. Against my will, I've been dragged all over Cyrodiil helping him commit petty crimes. You're a criminal. I wouldn't say we're thieves. I mean, we've stolen things, sure. But we've never stolen that much at one time. Just enough to keep us going. That still makes you a thief. That is until last year. Jorunda started to take risks and began robbing more dangerous targets. Not just lone merchants, mind you. I'm talking about the bigger scores, like estates and tax shipments. I begged him to stop, 
as I knew that his capers would one day lead to violence. Well, at least not violent thieves. He just threatened to hurt me if I got in his way. I think the gold changed him, I really do. He wasn't the man I met seven years ago. The few times I tried to say something, he'd strike me or push me away. I began to become frightened of him. This has certainly not become the quest I thought it was going to be. What does this have to do with me? Our last score was a tax shipment being delivered to the Imperial City. We robbed it, and in the midst of the chaos, Jorunda killed a guard. I was mortified. We snatched up the gold and holed up in the mountains. He said if I breathed a word of the murder to anyone, he'd kill me. I was terrified of him at this point. Two days later, the Bruma City Guard traced us to our makeshift campsite. I was off gathering food, but Jorunda was captured. Served him right. When I went back to the site later, the gold was gone. He'd moved it! What I need you to do is go to the Bruma Castle dungeons and speak to him for me. Convince him to tell you where the gold is and then we split it. This is interesting. He's not likely to just come out and tell you, so get creative. Um. Hey, you. There are Looks like you're handy with criminals you. in you're that house. Some. Can't really bring that up. Farewell. Uh. Eh, what the heck? I'll do it. I mean, it's kind of shady. But only semi shady. I don't know. It's a little shady, I guess, but I'll do it. Though I probably won't take a cut if I can avoid it. I'm still hoping I could just report this whole nonsense to the guards. Doing this for the little bit of gold. Oh, by the way, um, uh, I did erase about 200 saves, and then I got bored when I noticed I have 700s. So. Guess go this way. Hello. Talk to you. What can I do for you, sir? The Countess of Bruma. Rumors. This is the prisoner. What a bother. Don't be too long about it. I got to stay with you, so there isn't any funny business. Well, you're just a beam of sunshine, aren't you? Do I have, a, like, a... A ring of charisma? Do I have one of those or something? Probably not. If I strength, new. No. Prisoners may not accept gifts. Sure. Hello. I don't know who you are, nor do I care. All I know is that I want you to leave. Where's the gold? <laughs> That's my only option. Where's the gold? I'm not talking to you about anything. You're an outsider. I bet you're trying to trick me into telling something and the guards put you up to it. No! That fetcher of a guard, Terelius, is always trying to be sneaky. Well, you can forget it. Tell him it isn't going to work. I haven't got all day. I don't know who you... Maybe if I really make you like me. So... Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> I can just nice try. pay the hell out of you. What can I do? Who is Torellius? You too. Is that my quest to find Torellius? Don't get too close to the prisoners. Uh huh. Prisoners may not accept. Yes, gifts. I've heard you the first time. No touching the locks. Stop. 
No touching the locks. I'm not. We gonna have a problem? I haven't got all day. Neither do I. I'm just looking around. Don't get too close to the prisoners. I'll get as close as I want. Look, I'm rubbing up against the cell doors. What you gonna do? Too close to the prisoners. Don't get too close to the prisoners. Oh, for Pete's sake, stop! I bet I, I bet this whole thing is is become a prisoner. Free him, and then he'll take you to the thing. And what can I do? We're done here. Okay. Bye. You'd stop following me. And now I need to find this Tyronius character or whatever his name was. Probably the big boss. Guard, 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 jail jailer, guard, guard, guard. Are you Tyronius? What is it, sir? Renilius? Who the hell is Brandon? Although we can't go back and undo what's been done, I feel justice has been served and Brayden's soul may rest with ease. And who's Gilborn? In your absence, I dispatched a runner to Skinnegrad to let them know they needed to clear Gelleborn's name for the record books. Like Brayden, I think he deserves to have his name clear of wrongdoing. Who are these people? You did what had to be done. There should be no regrets or doubts in your mind about it. Raynal was an evil Dunmer, and he deserved that fate. Have you ever considered a job in law enforcement? Yes. I don't know who these people are. I know this is a captain of the guard well somewhere. Met. Greetings. You chilling up around here? It's something I can help you with. Mm, why can't I talk about she the Countess? She holds public audience in the Great Hall on weekday mornings. Farewell. Welcome back, my lord. Ah, oh, that Tyronius thing is probably a dead end. And getting arrested is where I drop it. I probably could just make him really, really like me, and he'll probably tell me. I might actually try that. Uh, let's see. Is there a way to drop quests? No, it doesn't look like it. So what I'm gonna have to do? I'm gonna go try to bribe the heck out of him. See if that works. You've got a real bounce to your step. Acrobat. I'm gonna go this way. This is probably locked. It is locked. Have to bother you again. What can I do for you, sir? What up? Go unlock the door. I know it's such a bother. I'm actually gonna scroll all the way down here. I need to delete a whole bunch of those saves later. Who? Evidence, huh? You know, you, get too close to the you can't even something. see me right now. You're literally talking to no one. I kind of wonder. Stop! Oh, you, violated you can't even see me! Then pay There's nothing even in there! Prisoners may not accept gifts. <laughs> what are you even talking about? Aye, aye, aye. May not accept gifts. Ah, hush. I don't know who... What if I bribe the heck I'm out of listening. him? Bribe. I'll take that... Every, every, thank you. How kind. I'm not talking to you. That fetch. Now, now. Get too close, to prisoners. Curses, he's immortal. Prisoners may not accept. 
It's all over, lawbreaker. <laughs> Your spree is at an end. <laughs> oh, it's always amusing. Load. That plan's not gonna work. No touching the locks. So really, my only two options now are see if I can find this person, Teronius, or murder the girl if I want this quest to be over. Or, you know, just ignore it forever, but... I'd rather drop quests than just not do them. I'm not getting arrested. I, I, I do draw the line there. Baker's food bag. So, that was kind of a waste of a time. Let's find something else. I could buy a horse. Woo! Eh, this is all DLC stuff, I think. Uh, da, da, da. Yep. Well, it's a house. Um, I somehow doubt this will be as easy as just walking inside and getting a place. You know what? Sure. It's like all the way over there. <laughs> okay, maybe not. Bah. I don't actually really have any more quests. Oh, that's buying a house, not buying a horse. Oh, my bad. I don't know why I was thinking that was buying a house. That's not actually buying a house. I can just go get the horse armor thing probably done with. Do the infamous horse horse armor mission. Let's do it. Let's get the jokes out of the way. Come, my my horse. <laughs> I'm here for my useless armor. Snock Grabura, owner and proprietor. We board horses and, well, we don't actually sell horses. Any more, that is. But you sell armor that does nothing. I'm here about the useless armor. What can I interest you in? I'd like... Ooh, interesting decision. However, I wanted to look. I'd like elven armor for my here horse. Here you are, just like I promised. Thanks again for all the help. I didn't even help you with anything. Hooray! My horse is armored. Ooh. Look at it. It is majestic. And useless. Come, my useless... <laughs> I'm sorry, now I'm just thinking about this, this invisible ghost riding on the back of a horse. <laughs> well, there's only one thing we can do now. Go quest hunting. What is it, citizen? Hail, good citizen. I believe there are actually is something for us to do almost immediately if I find it. It's been a while since I've been in the Imperial City. There it is, I think. Speed. Oh no, that's the arena. Thought there was a Ah, here we go! The wanted poster. The gray fox. Is 
Is there a problem? Let's talk about the Grey Fox. that thief that the Imperial Watch are always going on about. He likes to steal from rich folk. Still makes him a thief. He's just a... The nobility Rip. hate him. But the peasants Skip that. and the beggars love him. Especially on the waterfront. Long live the Empire. So what was his... What was the, the, the guy's name? Uh... Hermes Lex. I don't remember if I've talked to him before. I'd rather have someone else just repair it. I need to have to take the time to repair it. But now I've got to find him. Let's see. Where would I be? The palace. Market City Arena. I'd probably be near the palace. The palace and the barracks because you go hand in hand. That's the prison. That's the waterfront. Afternoon. Hello. Always nice to talk to someone pleasant. Let's go visit the Elder Council. We've actually been here before. Looking for the captain of the guard. Hopefully he can provide me with more information on this character. All visitors to the Imperial Palace are asked to keep their voices down, especially if council is in session. Basement probably doesn't have what I'm looking for, especially considering the fact that it's locked. All citizens are welcome in the I think he does just patrol. That door is locked. There is someone or something over there. Apparently I am welcome on the second floor. All visitors to the Imperial Palace are asked to keep their voices down, especially if Council is in session. No, I might be able to survive that fall. Probably not, though. Let's save. Let's see if we can survive the fall, and then we'll end the video. I'll save over here. Why not? Yeah! <coughs> ha! Hello, person. Excuse me. The Empire doesn't run itself. <laughs> Watch this. Even, even if I get this door open, the first response will be, You violated the law! No. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna see if I can do it. Auto attempt. Don't fail me now! Darn it. Now I have to murder you in cold blood. I missed. I'll try again. Yeah. Damn it, he's immortal. Yes, yes, I violated the law. Oh, I wanted to actually <laughs> run and jump on top of the center of the thing and see if it could ever reach me. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this. And then we'll actually end the video. Huzzah! I have come! I got to knock you unconscious, otherwise you'll just shoot me to death with magic. Come on, up here. There they come. Come on. Come! Arrest me! <laughs> he just sits back down in his chair and like nothing happened. Oh, this is hilarious. Thank you all for watching. This is Wilma Taco setting off. And <laughs> when we come back, we will be not here. We will be probably up there again. Where even is that upper area? Oh, man, that is a long fall. Thank you all for watching. See you all later. Bye bye. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll arrest me one of these days. One of these days. <laughs>